What is up everybody? It's your boy Insanity361 and in today's video we're hitting you with a little bit something different. Now instead of a subscription box, we'll be reviewing this. Now this is a high D Lao beef self-heating hot pot spicy flavor. Now if you don't know what hot pot is, hot pot is basically a Chinese cooking method where they boil flavored soup stock on the hot plate right at your dinner table and it's served with raw meat, veggies, breads, cheese, and much, much more. What you do is, as it's boiling, you know, you dip your meats in there. They thinly slice your meats, your, and then and then and your veggies and all that. You just boil it in there, cook it, and then you eat it, and oh my God, all the flavor gets on it. It is so freaking good. Now, this is a hot pot on the go, so, you know, I'm really interested to, side, to, to try this, you know what I mean? I saw it on Amazon, and I said, I was looking up self-heating food, right? And then I'm on Amazon, so I, and, I, and it came across this, and I'm like, what? Hot pot on the go? Come on, you know what I mean? So, yeah, I'm really, really interested in trying this out. This one cost me $15. Now, I know in China and in Japan and wherever else they sell these at, they're only like five bucks. But here, I guess, because it's like, there's not really, they don't really sell these here, so it cost me 15 bucks. And there's some on there that cost like 40 bucks, you know what I mean? But Nah, your boy, I ain't got that kind of cash, though, you know. So I'm like really, really interested in see how this thing tastes. You know? So, but before we get into that, I would appreciate it, greatly appreciate it, if you would hit that sub button, hit that notification bell to become part of the notified bona fide, so you can catch all my vids and all everything I review. Yeah, you know what I mean? So uh, just sit back, relax, and let's see what this thing tastes like. Yeah, man. What's good, everybody, man? How's y'all's day going? Remember, leave me some comments and let me know what you think of this after the video or between the video. It don't even matter. I would greatly appreciate that. Hit that thumbs up, too. Yeah, man. Now, let's get started. I'm so excited. Let's see what this bad boy tastes like. Let's tear it open. Yes, that's all the instructions. Pretty simple. Yeah. Hello, <laughs> dude. Chill. It's pretty simple. Pretty simple instructions. And if you want to know any of the nutrition facts, here you go. That's a total of, I would say, 790 calories total altogether. Feels a little gelatinous, but hopefully it tastes good. All right, and then you got a okay. We got a spoon and a chopstick. See chopsticks. Use utensils right here. Use your utensil bag. Let's see what else we got. We got the spicy flavor hot pot seasoning. Man, I know this is gonna be very hot. I just, I just have a feeling. It's gonna be very, very spicy. That's why your boy got his water right here. That's why I got this going on. And then it goes in here, and then we got some more stuff. We got us some pickled vegetables. They give you, hey, they give you a good amount. That's hefty. 
Yeah, man, that's dope. It's a lot of veggies. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't nothing wrong with veggies. Veggies are delicious. Every veggie. I never came across a veggie I didn't like. And this is your self-heating pad. This is what you heat it with. It's a chemical reaction when you put water into this and it makes it hot. Yeah, science, Mr. White. So, uh, yeah. We'll get that in there. Let's get that. But first, before we do all that, let's get situated right here. Okay, first we're going to... I'm thinking of going with the spicy flavor. Okay, hold on. Let me just read something. Just find out how much water to put. Okay, cool. Max line, let's get it. Now, we're gonna open this. Whew, right away. Wow. Oh, you can smell that right away. Oh. Yes, this is gonna be hot. all that flavors in there. Whew. Okay, that's hot. It smells hot too. Alright. Now we're gonna go with the vermicelli. I got this on my hands, but it don't matter. Beef don't smell too bad, actually. I ain't gonna lie, the beef don't smell too bad. It smells good. That beef, yeah, it does smell good. I like that. And then the pickle, pickle veggies, let's get it. Right here, this is lotus root. And then this green stuff right here, this is kelp. This is bamboo shoots. Water chestnuts. Ooh, it smells good. I wish y'all could smell this. This smells really, really good. Yeah, man, I'm so excited to try this. Damn. We're gonna add some water to the fill-up line in here. Go ahead and give this a little mix, you know, to get all that all that bottom mixed in this. quick with this because this is going to start real quick. It's a big chemical reaction. Put it on the bottom like that. 
And what you're gonna do, you're gonna fill to the line. Fill to the line. And you're gonna bring. Science, it shall work. You'll see some steam coming out there soon. Yeah, man. I don't know if y'all can hear that or see that, but this thing is steaming, like really, really steaming, yo. It is going off in there. You can see the smoke coming out from here. Damn, that's hot. But we cooking. So what you do now is you let this set for 15 minutes. So uh, with the magic of video, we're gonna, you know, skip ahead all that. So I'll catch y'all there. Yeah, man, let this thing cook. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time to open this bad boy up and try it. Yeah, man, I am waiting, let's get it. Now this is hot, this thing is hot. So you gotta be careful when you open this, all right? This is really, really hot. There you go. Ooh oh yeah, that looks so good, yo. That meat, look at that. Oh, yeah, man, this smells so good. I wish I could smell this. Those uh, vermicelli, look at that. Oh, all right. Well, there's only one way to know if it's good, right? Let's try this bad boy, see what's up. First, we're gonna try a, we're gonna try lotus root. I can get it, but these chopsticks are a little slippery. I'm used to wooden chopsticks. Right, let's go for it. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Whew. Oh, that is so spicy. <laughs> You know, the flavors really do get to it. It really soaks into this gourd or lotus fruit. It's a gourd, but it's, this is called lotus fruit. It is very, very good. Fried lotus fruit. Mm. I gotta try that again and get some more. But man, you can feel that going down the heat. But the but the taste is, mm, the taste is there, yo. Mm-hmm. Try this. A little bamboo shit. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. And the spice is there. It's so in your mouth and you can feel it behind your nose and everything. Mm. But it's good. Like I said, if you're a spicy person, you'll love this. Let's try some noodles with a little bit of kelp. Try to get a little bit more. It's slippery, yo. Look at that. Look at them noodles. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Cup tastes good. You know, for these being packaged, you know, mm, made to be on the go and stuff, they're pretty good. 
Now, I'm not saying this is better than any other hot pot, like at a restaurant or even if you make it at home, you know? Because that's way better. But for this bean to go and only taking 15 minutes to cook, and these pickled veggies being in the pouch and the meat, well, I haven't tried the meat yet, but it's really good. I'm not gonna lie. Sorry about that, everybody. I just realized I had my, I had my light off, but I turned it back on, no worries. Yeah, let's get into this. Man, my mouth is, ooh, it's feeling that heat, but I wanna try the meat. That's what I really wanna try. That's what I was like, kinda like, come on, is this gonna taste good? How's this gonna taste? Let's just take a bite out of this, see how it is. Oh man, some noodles wanna come, yeah. I don't want no noodles. Oh, let me just brown. Yeah, make it any easier for you, boy. Ah, that's good. Mm. Mm. The beef. The beef's all right. To me, my honest review, I'm just gonna be honest with y'all. I'm not really feeling the beef. It's like a little patty or something they put in here. You know what I mean? And I'm not with that. Mm -mm. It's like a little patty, like they just scrunch it up. And no, that is not good. That is not good to me. But let's try this. Some mushrooms. The mushroom is very, very good. I like that. But like I said, this is very, very hot stuff. I wish y'all could taste it. Whew. Go some more of them noodles, yeah. These noodles are bomb. I like them. Well, I do like vermicelli, so. As you know, so as you know, I know your boy's going for the vermicelli, yo. Mm. Oh, yeah. Now, this stuff is really good, everybody. For my final analysis, you know, it's very, very hot. But if you like hot, you'll love it. But um, the flavor is good. And, this, and, the, and the boil is good, you know what I mean? I mean, don't get me wrong, it's not as fresh and as authenticated as, you know, a homemade hot pot or the hot pot you get at the thing, like I said. But it's good, it does the job. I can see why people would like these, and I hope, you know, I hope over here in America, we can pick up something like this, you know, make it to our, you know, the way we like it. But all in all, it's good. And I'm gonna have to review this at a food tasting level, out of five stars. And out of five stars, I give this a three. And here's why I give it a three. Cause as good as it is, and that's, you know, I, this will get one person full, maybe two people, you never know. But as good as it is, it's just, it's hard to beat the real thing. You know what I mean? But if you can't get no hot pot where you are and you know, this is perfect for you. So if you wanna buy this, I'll have the link into this right in the description for y'all. So y'all can get y'all's very own and try it. And, do your own review, you know? Let me know how it goes. And if you want your boy to review anything else, you know, just go ahead and hit, hit leave a comment. Let me know. Talk to me. Be sure to thumbs up this video and let me know what y'all think, all right? So everybody have a good day. It's all peace and love and everything in between. Insanity. 361. Out. Yeah, man.